Woo! All right, first off, we have a video here, a story out of Cedar City, Utah. Not really a funny story, but certainly fascinating, interesting. Apparently, these confused waterfowl kind of did like a crash landing. They're flying above a not make it. So the survivors it was... were set free, though. The oh, survivors yeah, yeah. were set free, yes, but they it's were. unbelievable. Imagine, having, imagine being in the parking lot. I know, and scale. It was like a Hitchcock movie. It was like movie. raining birds. Very strange scene out there. So they're studying exactly what could have gone What's wrong going here. On? So those good folks in Cedar City, Utah, sorry about that. But that was, God, what a scene that must have been. Though. I know. Nose dive, oh, well, I weird. love this. I love this next one out of the Daily Mail because it's something that I always knew. Female bosses are better. See, I was a boss at one point. Female bosses are better. Thank you, Allison. Our boss is a female. I mean, women apparently are just more tolerant of staff checking Facebook or doing personal chores during office hours. Men, on the other hand, apparently are not tough. Well, no, they That's just understand kind of, kind that the there's gist. this work-life balance, and they understand that you can work. You don't have to be behind a desk. You can work in this day and age just about anywhere. A lot of people work on the weekends. They work on holidays, and they don't mind doing that extra work now at home. But you got to give your employees a little bit of slack. I, 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 in my career, three jobs, I've never had a male boss. I've oh. liked them all. So, you know, you hey, I'll, I'll go along with it. Plus, I'm addicted to Facebook, so <laughs> it works out. <laughs> all right, this story is going to rile you up. Apparently, this is in the New York Times. The Federal Aviation Administration.